Hello, everybody, and welcome back to uh, the portal. Hello. Where, by God, did I put that uh, music tab? There we go. You don't need to pick up any more extras right now, because we're going to go ahead and play some good old-fashioned uh, Portal Revolution. Oh, there's an update available. Hold on a second. From what I understand, this will take a uh, couple minutes, a couple seconds even. Oh, hello, Robert. Oh my god, baby. Mm. Also, there's a new portal mod. Yes, uh, it's on the. Yeah. It's on like it has its own Valve page and everything. What, 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 what's it called? Portal Revolution. We're playing it right now. Ooh. Mm -hmm. It's even got the fancy mod sticker on it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, also, I, uh, my ninja is now at level 90. Okay, nice. Ooh. What kind of class is that? You have a 90 now. I got, uh, all the tanks, ninja, samurai, reaper, sa and sage. Hmm. SMH, you aren't an omni healer. Nah, but I'm an omni tank. I'm an Omni Tank and an Omni Healer, so what does that mean? Wow. Yeah. Makes me an Omni Tank. More like an Omni Stank. Oh. Alrighty. Oh. Okay, wow, it sure is dark in here. I forgot about that. I can't. Or I can't remember if this is one of those broken ones or if this is like an actually functioning one. It seems like it actually works. Ah, no, nah, this bitch is busted. My God, it's but. So does this have any thought timeline thing? This is in between Portal One and Two. Oh, so who the fuck are we playing as? Uh, unnamed test subject woman. Unnamed test subject female. Oh, I already see I see what I'm, what I'm supposed to do here already. So we turn this shit off, and then that gives us access to certain things without having to actually worry about the portal. Without having to worry about the, the blockers. The fields. Yeah. The emancipation field. The emancipation station. I'll emancipate your... Station? Yurt. 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 Yurt? I don't have a yurt. Ah, Isaiah. Okay. Oh, I like how the portal gun's fucked up too. Yeah, it's a little bit damaged. For years, I've not been kind to this handheld aperture science portal device. And yet, the one shell gets in two in two proper is pristine. Eh, don't worry about it. Oh, hey, the door stays open. That's good. At least with Atlas and Peabody, it's it's understandable because the portal guns are made with them every time they die. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's see. Let me just drop this bitch over here. Or remade with them. Hmm. And we just gotta go turn back on the lights. Do you think they accounted for this in the, with, in the original design doc for this test chamber? Probably not, no. Granted, that probably makes it a little bit unsolvable, but you know what? I well, judging care. by that, <laughs> judging by that busted, uh, by that busted portal surface over there, that was probably meant to be like a perma portal. Oh yeah, that's right. Speaking of speaking of. Game mechanics and portals. Remember that one adver that one commercial they did where it was like the vacuum uh, tube, and that and that was never put in game. Hmm. Probably. I don't remember that, but I do. I imagine it existed. Hold on, let me find it. Right. Oh fuck. Uh, portals to promo, you know, videos. There we go. The perpetual testing initiative. Well, 
place, it's a good view. Life gets uh, a bit claustrophobic down in the facility. So we're trying to make our way to this spire so that we can uh, re-enable like, the cleaning functionalities for the facility so that way we can uh, get the fuck out of here. This dude's so kind as to even let us leave. I even got a chance to see the surface a little while ago. Unfortunately, I think you missed part of that. I mean, you can kind yeah. of you can kind of see outside during some of this part of the level, but still. God, whenever I hear Cave Johnson, I can only I can only hear Jameson. I mean, typically speaking, now whenever I think about uh, him, I think J.K. About, Simmons. Well, yeah, whenever I think about J.K. Simmons, I think about um, uh, Catherick Thorm. Boom! Catherick Thorm is one of the main antagonists of Baldur's Gate Three. Uh, oh shit. He is also the pneumatic diversity event. Here we go. He's also voiced by J.K. Simmons. Yes. Hmm. Okay. This thing. This thing was never implemented into the base game, but mm -hmm. it was advertised. Hmm. Let's well, so see. I can get myself over there. I think the major issue is this cube. Because there's some fucking there's some glass covering up this bitch right now. Uh, there's something under there. I'm guessing it's just... Oh, there's a power switch. Hold up. Ah, that makes things a bit easier then. Well, okay, not exactly. Because I need to be able to get the, the thing... I have to be able to get myself over there first. Oh, shit. If this isn't the last chamber, I'm going to assume you're doing this just to mess with me. Who's this feller? Uh... uh I'll admit Sterling? That. Yeah, Sterling. His name is Sterling. Was he an intern? A core? He is one it's of the core. Cores, yeah. He's the janitor. Mm. Uh... Maintenance core. Maintenance and cleaning. Mm-hmm. So which which company do you think was was less dangerous to work at, Aperture Science or Black Mesa? I mean, Black like, Mesa for sure. Yeah, absolutely. Because like, after a certain, well, like, there was a Mantis Men army that they had to fight at Aperture Science. Like they were just doing some downright illegal shit here at some point. Like let's be honest. Dave Johnson did not give a shit. He did whatever the fuck he wanted. By God, he wanted those pictures of Spider Man. He was gonna do anything to get them. Ah, okay. I can't exactly use that. All right, of course. Yeah. Nope. All right. Which catastrophic? Which catastrophic event was more survivable? The the Resonance Cascade or Glados's takeover? Probably the Resonance Cascade, actually. Like, if we're being honest for a second, I think it's the Resonance Cascade. Because, oh, yeah, true, because there actually were survivors. Now, I mean, if you want to talk about the 11-minute war, then, oh, no, fucking GLaDOS is taking over. Seven-hour... The seven-hour war? Like, yeah, no, way more people fucking died during that than Aperture Science. Oh, no, I was just strictly speaking workplace disaster. Mm -hmm. Like, not everybody at Black Mesa died. Everybody oh, yeah, like at Barney. Aperture died, though. Oh, yeah. Except for, like, Got two hard... people and a bunch of people in, like, in... Uh, what is it? For being rendered comatose, but uh, uh, for the most part, yeah, no, like... No, there, there was Chell and God's least schizophrenic soldier, Doug Ratman. Mm-hmm. Little, little, little rat boy. Uh, who could forget the rat boy? Well, let's think of the survivors of Black Mesa. There's Gordon, Eli, Kleiner, Barney... Adrian? Did Adrian Shepard survive? He did survive, yes. To my understanding, anyway. Oh, I mean, oh, Dr. Breen? Mm -hmm. Barney. Oh, yeah, I, 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 I said Barney already. Mm. So, one of the core problems. Hello. Was... Oh, hello, no one. I thought the core problem was that one guy was left around on a rail. 
Uh, well, he's not a problem at the moment. He's a solution. Now, if you want to talk about a, a core problem, problem, that's that. If you want to talk about a core problem, that's Wheatley. <laughs> oh, apparently, Alex was a survivor of the Black Mesa incident. Mm, yeah. And unknown amount of Peku uh, soldiers and unknown amount of Zen forces. So I think one of the core issues that I have to deal with right now, at the very least, is at some point or another, I have to be able to use this one, I think. Because... Maybe not, actually? Hmm. Because I... Well, no, this was just to show that you could move something over to there, yeah. Hmm. It's just that I need to be able to get over, like... Well, I think I need to be able to get over there? Not really. Hmm. Oh wait, hold on a second. I'm overthinking this a little bit. Here, let me see if I can actually like stand. Cause like if I can stand on this, then uh, okay, I can stand on it. We're good to go. Oh shit. Okay. Oh holy shit! Did you know that Kleiner ah! was supposed to appear? Kleiner was supposed to appear in Half Life Alex. The last chamber. I can I can assume. I can assume you're doing yeah. this just to mess with even has a full model. Mm -hmm. Yeah, He's even got a model. Sense. You know, I don't believe it. I thought they were going to cut out Alex. Destroy their legacy forever. <laughs> I am so smart. SMRT. SMRT. Okay, I might not be that smart. Because there's nothing what that I can you, really... What were you trying to accomplish? Well, so the big issue is that I need to be able to launch myself after I launch the cube over there, but I also need to get the cube over there to this side, because that's where the thing is. But the only problem is that there's a grid that only exists while the power is on. Yeah. But the problem is the launching force over here turns off once you turn off the power, and there's no floor... There's no floor things I can jump into to give myself momentum. Can't you... Isn't there a wall right there? Up in the... Or no, that's glass. Mm -hmm. Never mind. That is glass. Like, I can get the cube over there easily enough, but the only... The problem is me. And also being able to transfer the cube from one portion to another uh, without it becoming inaccessible. Well, so now I guess part of the question is, would I be able to... Hmm. Here, let me see. So maybe I'm a, I'm a, maybe I'm a little bit wrong. Maybe I can... Is there any point in this where I could hit the glat, where I could hit that? Yeah, nah. That's, that's angled pretty well so that you can't get it while you're doing the jump. Not to mention, I think most of this is an inaccessible... Actually, oh, wait a moment. Hold on. Yeah, no, wait a second. I was totally overthinking this a little bit, actually. Yeah, yeah. Uh, pretty simple solution, I think. Kind of? Mm. Hold on. Uh, boop. Now that I'm over here... Huh. Shit, where was I going with this? I was going somewhere with this. I had a plan. At some point here, there was a plan. Uh, fuck. Okay, so getting over here, that's one part. Um, mm. The issue is the power, but... I'm trying to think about how I make momentum for myself. Fuck. Hmm. Shit, where was I going with that? I mean, I guess at the very least, I know how to get myself over there. 
I guess the only real issue, like in order to get myself over there, technically I know what I got the thing over there. The only real issue is that I just don't know how to get both myself and the thing over there while the power is out. I also need to get back up there. Huh, crazy. Gordon's got a, got an in-game model for half life Alex too. Yeah, probably. What if... Hold on. Oh, wait, no, I'm stupid. If this isn't the last chamber, I'm going to assume you're doing this just to mess with me. I want to try... I'm going to try being a little bit silly about this. Ah, wait a minute, that's not the right... Okay, hold on a second. I almost had it. So I want to see what happens. Can I? Oh, no. Yeah, no, there's no good angle to get that at. Because if I could get the, cause if I could get the fucking cube over there by just popping it there, that would save me so much trouble. Holy shit. Mm. Mm. Scheisse. No, wait. No, I can't do that. Or maybe... Mm, hold on. <sighs> hold on, I think I have an idea. This might not be as technical as what they'd probably want me to do. Ah, but wait, no, I can't just set up a portal there, too. Unless... No, that's not how that would work, either. Fuck. Part of my thought is, what if I can, like, set up, set up the thing in such a way where, like, I can have the crate drop down, but keep, but keep it off to the side while the power is out? And then get it back over here, put it on the plate while the power is out, and then turn it back on, and then create, like, kind of like a mechanism to get it from point A to point B. I think I can do that, without, I think I can do that without it actually requiring me to, like, make sure that it shows up there as well. So, like, here, just... Oh, there it goes. Cool. I've seen some really crazy shit work as solutions to test chambers before. This isn't completely out of the question. So, here... Got this. I'm gonna go turn off the power. Go over here. You know, you know, seeing the state of disrepair this room was in, how the fuck did they expect employees to to access the the breaker box like that? They 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 did not. This was not intended <laughs> by any stretch of the imagination. <laughs> Are you saying things aren't going right here at Aperture Science? God no. Oh, here we go. Oh look, a breaker box. <laughs> Blinky. There we go. I was totally overthinking that. Holy shit. Put it down on the wrong surface. I should replay Portal 2. Good game. I replayed it on the Switch recently. I should replay a lot of Valve games. I haven't mean to play a replay uh, Half-Life 2. The only problem is for some reason none of the fucking Source games on my Steam Deck have audio. Whack. <laughs> my brother in Christ, you made the games! <laughs> I 
remember correctly, weren't they putting out a few updates for for the for their older Source games to make them compatible with Steam Deck? A little bit, yeah. Mm -hmm. Like just a, like making minor adjustments to menus and stuff. Yeah. Oh, did you hear that? This fire reaches from the bottommost parts of the facility all the way up to the surface. You certainly don't want to fall down that shaft. After you. Yeah, yeah. That place looks like White Forest. Yeah, a little bit. Hey, Rende. Hey, Rende. We're in the spire. Uh, we made it. Nah. Did anything interesting happen when you turned up the power? Uh, nothing. You say something about power? Say stuff again. Your your mic's a little bit wonky at the moment. Like I remember, right after I finished, right after the last room ended, you got to a level where you turned off the power in the level. Yeah, there was a handful of puzzles that revolved around me, just kind of ostensibly breaking tests that were already broken, so that you could just solve mm -hmm. them by like by turning certain aspects of it off. Mm -hmm. Okay, guess not. My phone vibrated. <gasps> my thing's on the way. Mm, hey. mm. What thing is on the way? Um, I ordered a copy of the uh, album When the Pawn uh, by Fiona Apple. That's not the full name. The actual length of the album title is like a mile long. So it is shortened down to When the Pawn. <laughs> A machine. Let's look. Oh my up. god, that is a mile long title. Seem complicated. <laughs> oh. Hey. You know, the sad part is they don't have a picture of the cover. Yeah, unfortunately, most of the album, like, uh, most like the album re releases, don't have the proper cover on them for some reason. <laughs> Wait, that's it? You just need to press a button. Well, that's kind of underwhelming. Whatever. It's powering up. You'll soon see. And it's just like Chumba Wumba all over again. Run a series of checks. Uh, there should be a cube arriving near you any second. Uh, okay. All right, companion cube. Oh. Yay! Is it a boy? Let's put that into the specimen chamber on the left. I choose to believe that this is a boy. A lot of people depict Companion Cube as a boy, yeah. Starting first test on an Probably because if all goes uh, long, Chell, will be Chell is a girl. And I mean, as you want every other character. The obvious yeah. ship. Now. Every other character in Portal 1 is a girl. Mm. No, Portal 1 and Portal 2 is the same character. Yeah, I know. Oh, no, I mean, in Portal like 2, there's, there's boy characters, in one there aren't. Like your handheld portal device need to place physical portals mm -hmm. to achieve teleportation. This little guy can instantly Ash travel two volumes of space in the whole universe. We that sounds like something Black Mesa said there was. Oh, wait, that is something Black Mesa designed. Through walls while this thing just bypasses our three dimensional plane. Anyway, let's recycle that cube. Gotta clean up after ourselves. Oh, no. Lana! Oh, well, do you want you to do it? Don't do it. <laughs> Whee! Yeah, it certainly is not. Oh, wow, okay. Right. I want to see there's an achievement for just throwing yourself in the air. <laughs> Pretty sure that is an achievement in the original portal. Mm -hmm. No! Aw, oh, damn it, I'm trying to fucking. He loved you, though. I'm... Test we need to pass. So we have to First do it again? I have to put my soul for the portal? Alright. There's no sure, way this nothing can go wrong. Happen. I love the fly. Turn into a pickle more than the on the ship. Bring her back. 
don't you think? That monster spread her parts all over the facility. Even the parking lot. True. She did end up, end, end up in the parking lot. Together with that whisk machine. <laughs> to start the test oh i see you're gonna teleport me to all the various places where her body parts are <laughs> oh That's mm -hmm. what are you doing in there uh, get out of there what i can't turn it off i don't exactly have the option to leave i love half-life 2. Oh, hi old aperture you're back thought i lost you yes i mean like zen or something that'd be funny I know, I'm just <laughs> give me a second uh, test room. This is the actual bit from Half Life Two. A little bit. Gotta be quick about this before you leave again. It's a good bit. Ready. Yeah. All right, where am I going now? What's next? The the funny fish. Uh. Is it? Will it be the liar's cake that you can never eat? Whoa. The cutting room floor. Oh. oh boy. I can't. Ah, damn, my shit's uh -oh. broke. Oh. Oh, we had old aperture. Huh. I mean, they did say that her parts were all over the old Don't facility. forget to bring a parachute. Damn, so I just don't get a portal device anymore? Fuck. At least for now. Well, no, they're gonna give you one portal back, and then halfway through, you'll get the other portal. Yeah. We're doing this shit again. <laughs> it's it's ghosts and start, goblins. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't think that's a. I'll try one, 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 uh, one. Thank you for not loitering longer than twenty minutes. <laughs> they legit have signs that say that. Keep out. Mm -hmm. Like out here. Mm -hmm. Ah, oh, damn, you, you know some chill-ass discussions happened there. <laughs> Here, fuck Over you. a couple brewskis. More, over, more over, monumental... Over beans and water. <laughs> more monumental oh, discoveries have been made here than throughout the entirety of Aperture. <laughs> more what? So, more monumental discoveries. <laughs> this is where the portal gun was created. Dude, what if you could just like oh, follow the chat? Oh, are we doing the cum puzzles? <sighs> Bro, what if you could just like teleport from one place to another? <gasps> oh boy, is it cum puzzle time? I don't know, man. Fuck, that doesn't happen. Why do you Why do you ask that every puzzle game we play? <laughs> Not Listen, every it's puzzle especially game has cum in it. Listen, it's especially what? applicable to Portal Two for. I'm just I'm just know. saying there's some carryover, but it, it's it's odd that you point it out so often. And then I'm gonna get moon asbestos and die. Thought it was super asbestos. Super asbestos. Well, yeah, it's super because it's from the moon. Asbestos. Oh, true. It's the bestest asbestos. Can't wait for this fucking. Can't wait for there to be like ant lion spotted. Pick up gun. Objective kill. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> it's time to chew ass. The events of flood. The event of flooding. Seek air pot. Oh, we're doing an underwater section, aren't we? Airlock. More Just like seek air. some air pockets, though. Oh. More like air. More like air cock. No, it's an air cocket. I'm sorry, the correct right. joke was going to be cocket. Yes, yeah, you, see, you've, you've completely cocketed this one. No, no, I said airlock earlier. No, but it should have been air cock. Uh, I'll cock your air. <laughs> no? uh, what, Mantis Man? Oh. Blue. I guess the power's on a little bit now. Fuck! Imagine you had to actually f had to actually deal with one of the um, a leftover mantis man. Surprise horror section. <laughs> like it's like that bit from Half Life Alex. Hello, everybody. This... It's me, Ratman. I've been here the whole time. <laughs> he says to a brick wall. Hmm. Actually, yes, yeah, so yeah. This was part of the. Um... I remember this bit. This was part of the original portal too, as well. What's the papers, please, Ram? I don't know why this segment reminds me of Dead Space One. 
I mean, to be fair, we are going through like a brown, old, like an old, decrepit facility. Gray, but like, mm -hmm. but like the part where it's like a reception area with like waiting rooms. It reminds me of the train stations from the Ishimura. I wouldn't mind doing Dead Space One on stream at some point. Probably the remake version, though. I played the first one enough times. Oh, uh, elevator, I guess. Oh. Look at this comedically large red button. To be fair, I'd like my workplace a lot more if it was full of comedically red w w buttons. I'm just saying. Is it just me or did you turn 5'11"? Eh. Everything looks so much bigger now. I don't really think so. I don't know. If you feel shorter... What, what, what if something happened to the long fall boots? You may work with robots, but you can't take a bullet like one. Uh, I mean, I, I'm pretty sure I'm... I still have the boots. I don't think I'd be a lie. Oh, actually, no, that's right. I you don't know me. Here. I'm built different. Wait, what the fuck? Keep... Was that what the Mantis Men are held? Ele <laughs> elevated a surface. No. <laughs> <laughs> I think that was like the third one. Hmm. Shit's probably broke. There's something surprising about like being down in a place like this and there's just like nobody talking. It's considered especially considering that like that portal is well known for its mile a minute um ha ha he who ha ha's. <laughs> well that's portal too. Yeah, that's portal portal one is okay. Mm -hmm. I saw I saw some of the Skyrim ones is like Portal One is a puzzle game with comedy and Portal Two is a comedy game with some puzzle in it. True. Yeah. With Steven starring Steven Merchant. Oh, Steven. I spoke too soon. How was that? Okay, good. <clears throat> Wait, Steve. You're standing here. Tells me that you want to help us revolutionize. I don't know, but she sounds mighty Australian. Carolyn got an Australian like accent at some point. <laughs> cool, blow me. Strafe. Aperture Australia. The Aperture Sydney in Australia. Are we not finishing my part? Oh boy, those mannequins. I look, look, what do I do with that over there? Fabulous 50. After purchasing a salt mine in Upper Michigan from performance profits made in the military grade shower curtain business since Maverick Cave <coughs> Johnson founded Aperture Science Innovators, or Science Maverick Cave Johnson. Uh, embracing change. Fostering inclusivity. In response to the 1968 Senate hearing on missing astronauts, Aperture Science expanded its product testing to include participants outside the country's elite class of human resources. Donating science. What? The highly popular $60 science contribution reward enabled hundreds of low-income families to secure a regular- Oh yeah, that's right. 60 whole dollars, baby. Oh. Hey, hey, uh, the, the portal, grab it. No, it's a prop. Oh, no, it's not. It's or not. No, it's not. Oh. Why did- red Oh, it's got red po- Oh, uh, this is the classic portals! Wait, 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 what do you yeah. like? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the beta ones! The Oh, yeah. beta. Now but it's an old one, get it? Oh, that's clever. I like that. Let's go. Wait, what does your character model look like? Because you can act if you do it in the corner. I know. You can, you can kind of see me. Yeah, see? Oh, you can, you can see yourself clear if you put them like perpendicular to each other. Yeah. Uh, I'm a generic mm. woman. woman. Yes. Damn. <laughs> Male. Boo. I, I got the white woman scare me. No, I got boobs. Yeah, really just stuck a, work, a working portal device on this. <laughs> And well, show I mean, area. No one's considering, gonna take it. <laughs> considering I'm clearly aperture, still here. <laughs> I mean, Rindy, considering the shit apertures pulled in the past, ah, this isn't out of character. <laughs> and they just, hey, wait, pulled. this wall isn't completely white. What the fuck? <laughs> I guess they used moon jealous paint back then. Hmm. Oh, I love it's asbestos. I love free asbestos poisoning. I love asbestos. Yummy, yummy, I eat it every day. Remember back in Portal 1 when the portals had travel? When the portal gun shots had travel time? Yes. We actually talked about that a little bit last time. Oh, did you? Yes. You know what my first experience with Valve games was? Hmm. On the In the orange box on, on Xbox 360. Yeah, same. Wee! Ow. Ah! That would have killed you. Eh, yeah, we're fine. We're living. You got long fall boots on all sides of your body. Mm -hmm. I have long fall bones. 
<laughs> I hear, where's that Maybe. elevator shaft again? Actually, hold on. Ooh. Really? There's no, like, big, long drop? Okay. Nope, uh, maybe go back to the elevator shaft. Yeah, I guess like a good shaft did. Go up and down the shaft. Wee! Ow. Blit! Uh, cue the comedic, cue the slapstick uh, sliding along a window pane sound effect. <laughs> <laughs> My new boss is a robot! Did, but did you know robots are smarter? Work harder and are better than you. <laughs> Try out the cakes. Tasty. <laughs> I actually really like Black <laughs> Forest. <laughs> you know, it's because of Portal that I actually that Black Forest cake is my favorite. I remember. You know, it's actually kind of funny because I like I used to really like Portal when I was younger. Um, well, okay, I really I still like really like Portal, but I also was like it was my thing when I was younger. And there was like a wood shopping class, like trying to teach us like how to make stuff. I was like, I want to make a replica of the portal cake. And then my teacher was like, that's way too advanced. Just make a piggy bank with a picture of a cake on it. I'm like, oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> Wait, what's so hard to make about it? What's so hard to make with to a cake? To be fair, it was a pretty big cake. <laughs> oh, I thought it was the complexity of it. It's like, it's a, it's a, it's a cake. Maybe it's the strawberries on top? That was complicated. There's a... There's a lot of different things, but like the core, the core crux of it was literally just I was going to, I was just going to like, what's it? Like the top would open, you could like store things on the inside. Oh, that's neat. Mm -hmm. you know, it would have been really funny if you said you were gonna make the portal gun. Mm -hmm. That that is, I think that requires an amount of mapping that we cannot fathom yet. Uh, especially for a four for a fourth grader in a. Wood like what's that over there? Class. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Behind you, on top. What's that? Testing track lambda. That's a lambda, and that maybe it's gonna be like a half by fraction. Great Yo, witch lambda. lambda delta. Gordon! <laughs> Imagine that we okay. say lambda, we say lambda, the instant we say lambda, B joins the call. <laughs> <laughs> lambda delta. Oh, joyous day! A package is on the way. It's probably, it's probably that record I ordered. <laughs> why, the Hello, fuck I, why the fuck do I have a knife on my desk? Man, you have a lot of shit on. You, why don't you, you just put them away? You say that like it's like it's a problem you can't solve. Bro, like, like have to oh man! You stop playing with the knife on your desk. Why are you no, surprised? This is just, no, no, this isn't the butterfly knife. This is the regular steak knife. Mm. Why do you have a steak knife? This isn't the knife, knife I fell asleep I with. All right, it was. Be We're trying something different with this test. If you've worked in device development, then you'll know what this is already. But if you don't, that will actually give us better data. So just have fun with it. It oh, shouldn't tube. be able to hurt you. Is that uh, the the okay. diversity tube? Maybe. <coughs> the pneumatic diversity vent. Holy mm -hmm. shit! They actually managed to put it in. Oh, that's why this is called the cutting room floor. Riveting. It's all beta themed stuff. <laughs> that's fun. Riveting. <laughs> Where'd the cube go? Okay, uh, bro, wait, but uh, where's the new one? Oh, there we go. I didn't even. Wait, what happened to the shit. old one? I hit the button that deletes it by accident. Oh. <laughs> all right, now now the real test is: Will it be able to suck out the pan? Will it be able to suck out the panels from a wall? <laughs> Because that was one of the main things that they advertised with it. Mm -hmm. uh, who knows? And also, will the gust be able to go through the portals? Who knows? <clears throat> ah, fire. My favorite cut asset from What the fuck? Oh. I thought that was a burning head crab. Oh, great, those turrets. To remind everybody who didn't read the introductory guidebook about ah. diversity events, all yep. pneumatic diversity events in test chambers have been calibrated to a maximum capacity of 60 kilograms. <laughs> I was just talking about this. From being sucked up and disposed of. If your body mass happens to be under 60 kilograms, extra caution is advised. So you're saying being fat is a good thing? Yeah. Oh, I remember why I have this knife now. Were you eating steak? I was cutting a Toblerone. Why were you That's cutting a Toblerone? 
Because it was one of the ve it was one of those comedically large ones. You can break those pretty okay. easily without a knife. And it yeah. was and it was on the last create and delete. And it was on the last two triangles. They are created specifically for you to break them off. Without needing to cut them. No, no, no. It was the last two. It, it would have been a pain to break them off. Well Just done. mush it together. The following test chambers may Tried that. It only snapped the top. Like these, in order to measure how test subjects behave in environments lacking human contact. Good luck. I was busy for the next <laughs> couple of test chambers. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, you know how expensive voice acting is? <laughs> True. Hey, speaking of knives, Rindy, I got Ninja to 90. Nine. You know, credit where credit's due. They may have had robots replace people sometimes, but they got people to do the to do the, the, the over the intercom dialogue. And that's more charitable than most companies in the modern day. <laughs> yeah, especially fucking SAG AFTRA. Mm-hmm. What the fuck was the strike for? Um, uh, uh, it would have not been voice <laughs> actors, apparently. Yeah, it was, a, yeah. It, was a, it was a it was a writer's strike, but yeah. No, wasn't there also there a was o strike there was on also an actor strike? Well, yeah, yeah. It was they for both struck. The actors, mm. but not the voice actors. It was for the real actors. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think it's funny how, like, see, all the affected parties actually agreed on this, and then every single voice actor of all time went, no, we didn't. <laughs> uh, no, we, nuh -uh. Steve Bloom, literally one of the most prolific voice actors ever, was like, I wasn't even fucking asked about this, and I'm a sag after <laughs> member. <laughs> Look, it's simple, they're just gonna stop. God, where are we where the unions are turning against us? Holy shit. Look, don't worry, everybody. You know, we have some experience with voice actors and we hate computers. Ignore how I'm streaming right now. Uh, we'll become a new union for you. <laughs> oh, I, the down, uh, I have no experience with legalese, but I have Me? Wikipedia, so I <laughs> can be a resource for law, specifically and I related to voice actors. <laughs> and I watched Better Call Saul. <laughs> I can I can quote chicanery line for line. <laughs> that a dead core? Yeah, I guess so. It's just a ball. You can't pick it up. Or an an inert core. Maybe it'll start moving at some point just to fuck with me. Yeah, that'll be pretty funny. Oh, oh there's another there's inert more core. Of one. Oh boy. Yeah, probably oh, to find like this? one this more. Wait a minute. There's oh. another disc like that earlier. Remember? Yeah. Find mm -hmm. the funny disc. Find disc. Where's disc? I need disc. Maybe you'll have to turn the lights on to find the disc. No, I wasn't allowed to activate it until I found the disc. I see. Ooh. Not now, Nikkei! <laughs> like, actually, genuinely, I got- It's nope. a starting system update for Nikkei right as I fucking hit the switch. Oh, hey! Done? Oh! 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 Oh, I uh, guess I stand corrected. <laughs> what's going on here? Well, we don't know core. Oh, yeah, okay, that's a bit nice. It's a GLaDOS scenario! Yeah. Well, kinda. Okay. This was like, based off of Caroline, but it looks like in this case it just took us the whole thing. Mm. Wait, so they're uploading people into robots? Looks like it. Yep. That was like the not Caroline, but someone else. So mm -hmm. Let's go there. <clears throat> Hey, you know it'd be pretty crazy if the uh, if the if the main character was became Wheatley. You know it's kind of funny. Because main character's a woman. Yeah. That's oh funny. right, shit. By the way, where is everybody? Is the office closed? I have and some horrible news from you. Oh, so Wheatley already exists talk. at this point. Yeah. Yeah. All oh, right. I mean, we don't have to go through there, do we? I completely understand. Probably still voiced by Stephen Merchant. Not in this fucking thing. You think they got the money? They to can't Steven afford him. <laughs> My favorite part about Steven Merchant is I saw what he looked like and I'm like, wow, he looks like Wheatley if he was a human. Oh, there we go. See, mechanics. Oh yeah, you're right. Wow. He looks like how he looks like how Wheatley would. Oh, you think Wheatley would look? He's doing the Wheatley stare. <laughs> So, so really tall. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, yeah, you're right. Holy shit. <laughs> He's six foot seven. 
Holy, Holy fuck. shit. Oh my god. The short, that, that, for comparison's sake, that's the shortest Listen, Dutch man. I'm sorry for... Ah, my eyes! Ah. My bad. I didn't mean to overexpose your eyes. You mean flashbang me? Good, that's a good bit. That's a good bit. I like that. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's right. I was gonna mention when I was younger, and they mentioned like putting Caroline onto a disc okay. and having her run the facility. Wait, I thought they meant physically mean? like smushing her brain into a disc. <laughs> I mean, that's funnier. I mean, that that sounds horrifying. Are you kidding me? <laughs> just just sloppily mashing her brain onto a disc and putting it in the CD ROM. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know what year it is either. Try to get this door open. Stick me on that plug in the wall. I'll see what I can do. You're taking not being a person anymore awfully well. Uh, where'd Which you go? Have... Oh, no. Oh. Oh, what? Okay. Good enough, I guess. Oh, it, like, turned around, I guess? Something with her inside? That's... Something? You know, I'm not gonna question it. Don't get me, please. What? Oh! Don't forget oh. her. How did you... Is that uh -oh. her? Can you oh, press Satan? Oh, she's... Oh, she's floating in midair. Yeah, oh, no. okay. Rip. Hold on, go into the uh, depth console. Me... What? No, I'm just gonna reload the save. Oh. Uh, I mean, would it be easier to just no clip and grab her? Probably not, unfortunately. I mean, I guess, but also there's achievements, and I don't, I don't uh, imagine, I don't imagine I'll be able to get them by turning on SV cheats. But if I just click on this, will it let me? No. Oh no, we. It's not gonna fucking open the door until. Okay. And let me, let me reload a save. Tragic. Okay, I don't think it brought me back. Okay, we just have to redo that bit. All right, speed run, let's go. Wham, bam. Da -da 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 -da. Orange in its default state of mind. Oh, there we are. Got a little bit of distance. Wait, does B hopping work? You can find your way. Uh, but will he find his one way? B hopping would require me to bind. Uh, jump to my the mouse wheel. To my mouse wheel, but also I think they patched that Hope out. Hope works. And later in this creations. version of this. Yeah. In this version of the source engine, yeah. It only works in source in like an earlier source games, unfortunately. Probably works in Half Life 2. It, Actually, it does work in Half Life 2, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's like the main thing because I use it for. Also, pretty sure it works in Counter Strike Source. Mm -hmm. Who the fuck plays that? Um, the Lebanese. Actually, no, the only people who play who have Counter Strike Source are Gary's mod players. The Lebanese. All right, true. All right, disc, 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 disc. Oh yeah, do you know this this game was playing Tiny Road? Mm hmm. Look at this boss I ran into just a bit earlier. Oh, that's fun. It's oh, good. joy. Yo, it's Bog and Smornston. Like, earlier in that stage, I was like, huh, there's these big knights with a shield. Are they kind of remind me of the Dark Souls knights. And then I ran into this boss, like, oh, okay. Smorn. It's Smorn and Bogstein. It's, it's, it's Pornstein and, and, and Plo. Try harder. Oh, lady, I'm sorry. How did you, how did you make a deep sigh? Uh, I guess audio box. <sighs> no lungs. No. <laughs> she got simulated lungs. Simple as. Thanks. Tashi's talking, I guess. Look, it's Let's more funny if we don't worry about the semantics. By the way, I could take the speech and make a blowing noise. Is the office closed? <laughs> And what is a test subject doing here anyway? That's really dark. Light switch anywhere? I'm oh, I'm not allowed to move until they turn on the lights. It's probably just the probably just a fucking cube around this place until it activates. Just the absence of light, right? What reason would anyone? Let's call it the boundary break, guys. You're a robot. What do you have to be afraid of anymore? <laughs> uh, eternity. True, eternity is pretty scary. Like you see, plan, I personally believe in the pillars of eternity. Wandering through the office after uh, that was horrible. With a stranger Never quote me on that. A <laughs> Listen, I'm sorry for. Oh, I'm so sorry. 
My bad. I didn't mean to overexpose your eyes. All right, make sure to stay before you put her in. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's the plan, Stan. Okay. The fuck? Why is not Stan? Wait, what happened here? Look out the window, please. All right. Just gonna go ahead and do an essay. Mm -hmm. Trying not to panic again. Can you tell me what year it is? Oh, you don't know either? Guess we're in the same boat then. I don't think they make Let's calendars anymore. Let's try to get this door open. Stick me on that plug in the wall. I'll see what I can do. Okay. Got it. Woo. There, there go. we go. Okay. None of this used to be here. How long was I out for? It must have been decades. I don't really know where we're going now. Oh, let's try and find a management rail. Then I can access the whole network. She has taken this extremely well. It's kind of hard to like... I mean, I don't know, it would be supposed to have some like countermeasures okay. on these things sure. to like make it so they don't go What's fucking the insane once there? they've been But also it's just... might, she might have known this would happen. They're probably like, hey, can you come in here for a brain scam one of these days? Don't worry about it. <laughs> can I ask you something real quick? I'm sorry, you it's lost the, the you, <laughs> you, you lost you, you lost the coin flip. Looks to be fair, this is probably like a this is like a Soma situation. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I like this course design in the safe through beats. Mm -hmm. The black and it's the like, black and white and blue. It's like it's, it's like one of those controllers. True, 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 true. Yeah. Yeah. I love see through controller <laughs> shit. Like, oh yeah, it is see through. I, I might not like Starfield very much, but I like the controller for it because the triggers are see through. <laughs> more like more like slop field. Oh yeah, no, like you, you are genuinely right with that ass assessment. The Starfield is like actually genuine. Like, okay, so that to be fair, most of Bethesda games are pretty slop adjacent. Uh, but like, Starfield is uh, is the omni slop. <laughs> it's never been more slop than this. <laughs> I don't know how they managed to take Fallout 4's formula and manage to uninnovate it. To be fair, to Fallout, innovate it. To be fair, Fallout 4 in and of itself was kind of bland. It just had the wrapper of its Fallout, and you inherently have like an emotional connection sorry. to it. Again, I'm sorry for my erratic introduction. I'm Amelia Conley, and I work in Aperture's research group for artificial intelligence. Oh! I did. Until now. See, my main contributions eh. were in the field of brain scanning. She didn't lose the coin flip. She's the one who flipped the coin. We enforced strict backup removal routines so we wouldn't accidentally clone our minds. But here we are. Oh. Why'd they put the button there then? Oh, I know why. Because I need the key for something else. Oh, I gotta put the cube there in there. Okay. Oh. You gonna. Uh. No. Gonna... no. Okay. Is this the out tube then? I think uh, it just looks like it's going to be a The blue tarp made me think it was the blue bouncy goo. <laughs> really struggling the goo to that hold makes back you the bounce. Now. I read the records <laughs> of what happened while I was out. Everyone Look forward to the uh, test them. chamber themed uh, puzzles. Oh, oh, I guess she would make Gladys. Oh, wow. I created the yeah. yeah, she literally <laughs> created Gladys. Yeah, yeah. Well, my human self did. I have no memory of this, but the records are clear. Huh. Also, the scan is from before that. Oh. Oh, damn. Yeah, they did. That is true. They, they did do it non-consensually, yeah. Yeah. 
I can see why GLaDOS is a bit upset, huh? <laughs> I mean, GLaDOS resolved in the end of World of Two that it doesn't matter. And she's like, she's she's pissed off because she's GLaDOS, yeah. not because of Carolyn. <laughs> Carolyn seems to be buried yeah, more okay, inside right? GLaDOS. Like, but GLaDOS is her own thing. But didn't she delete okay. Carolyn at the end of Portal 2? No, yeah. she did. Yeah. No, she did. Wait, no, 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 remember the, remember the song? She said that now little Carolyn's in me, too. She was making a front. Like, literally, the, oh. the entirety, what are you, t okay, hold on a second, do you actually know the- The canonicity of the songs is no, dubious. No, hold on a second, okay, but you know the giant turret orchestra? You know, yeah. the entire song is about how she loves Chell and wishes her safe travels afterwards. And she gives her a box with a heart on it. <laughs> she oh, the she box with absolutely heart on adores it. Chell and she's sad the to see her go. <laughs> the canonicity is so dubious. The song called Still Alive is about how she's The song dead. is extremely dubious, yes. <laughs> Like I'm just saying, I don't. I, don't I think I think Gladys is what's, putting on a bit is, of a front. What does the song have to do with it. whether or not Carolyn's still alive? I'm saying that she's like lying to you at like every step of the way. She actually really cares about Chell a lot. She's just putting on a brave face because she knows. Sundere Glados. Yeah, she's a this is, soon. Head, this is head cannon, and that's fair. But can extremely dubious canonicity. To be fair, the, the to be fair, the orchestra bit was super real though. <laughs> Yo, it's the orange. It's it, it, it's the Yugu. What's that? It's the bird. Oh, it's red. I feel like if Gladys likes Chell, it's mostly the, because Chell is a very good cast subject. Or that's the that's the Sonic the Hedgehog goo. Considering uh, that her whole fucking thing in the co-op campaign is I fucking burn through every other human in the facility trying to find <laughs> someone as good at testing as Shell. <laughs> Look, I'm just saying, P Portal 2's got some good oh, Yuri it in the... it. It's got some real good <laughs> Yuri in it. <laughs> Wait, maybe put it on the ground? Like, put it perpendicular to the I'm ground? Not to, perpendicular like, to it. I'm trying to find, like, the best, the best. It's like, why is this thread? Is this going to kill you when you go through? Yeah, no, that yeah. kills you when you run through it, yeah. Oh, okay. There was a field Orange, uh, like this much earlier on in the game. I'm talking about the white one down there, over there. Mm -hmm. To your left. There. There you go. Cool, now I can just run through it and die. <laughs> I can kill myself even faster now. Let's go. I uh, can... No, you, you have a death penalty. Oh, I know. Yeah. Yee! Oh, God, okay. I love the goop. I, I love the goop <laughs> puzzles. Wait, what's this actually? Fifty Shades of Lemonade. Fifty the Shades of Lemonade. Nobody is talking about. <laughs> Hold on a second. Oh, shit. I like it's a full box, which implies nobody took them. I'm yeah, nobody's talking about it. I am fifty. I am fifty-one. Cave Johnson with an E. J Cave Johnson. Cave Johnson. And I am the CEO of Extra Science. I'm not really familiar with lemons or lemonade until the lemon was introduced to me. Together with the team, including the best scientists of our generation, I researched 50 shades of lemonade to very sweet and shady to not so sweet and shady. <laughs> very acidic. I know, was this one? Ah, it's just showing oh. stuff on there. Shut down. Stop again. Let me light this up for you. Yeah, yeah. Ah! I can't remember. Thank you. Thank you. Woo! Can you, turn the, can you turn the ship back on now? <laughs> I find the dark mildly uncomfortable. With what hands? Fuck. <laughs> oh, you I go through that door? Ah, shit. Hold on. You think Gordon Freeman would survive the test subject? Probably. Probably. Dude, dude, dude was pretty good at his job. <laughs> Wasn't really his fault that, that a resonance cascade happened. <laughs> I really don't think you need to go back out there. I do, so I can put a portal in the office where the power switch is. Do you need the power back on? Yes. Ah, shit. Oh, oh there we go. Well, you yeah, hit your because, head. Yeah, the door won't open unless I turn back on the power. Oh, I see. Wait, what, what are you doing? 
What? I gotta go get. I gotta get back over here to put a portal over there. Oh, okay. I see it. Oh. What was? Nope. I swear these earthquakes aren't normal here. What is oh. that? Oh no, he's fucking shit up, isn't he? <laughs> mm -hmm. Didn't get you back or something. Sterling, no! You weren't supposed to be Wheatley! <laughs> <laughs> ah, there we go. Door. What's up? Haven't been here in a while. Wow, this hasn't changed a bit. It's just I as dark and decrepit as you remember. Boring presentation room. For some reason, <laughs> the presentation rooms were assigned special roles. This is the boring one, where only really <laughs> uninteresting topics get presented. I worked next to the presentation room of danger. Well, that's its nickname. What they pitch there is shocking at first, but it didn't take me long to get numb to it. Mannequins? Hmm. Interesting. Oh. I reckon I could find a humanoid android body somewhere around here. I forgot what it feels like to have hands. I mean, there was the... You know, there is that, you know, there is that thing that I read about how, uh, to spe specifically to make Chell feel bad, GLaDOS made a, made a humanoid body that is, uh, physically and superior to her in every conceivable way. But she threw it out when Chell wasn't really phased by it, she just kind of kept looking at her in a way that was, um, dubious to say the least. <laughs> hmm. That's not a door. Uh, Real place. fake doors. This place is just fucking full of fake ass doors that don't that, that, that don't go anywhere. Is there something I hear I'm missing? Oh, there's buttons. Oh. Oh. No hands, only handles. That's a lie. You can do <laughs> handles. Oh, right, it could be hell with handles, and that's something that a lot of people could really use. True. My ass could go for a snuggle right now, TBH. Over here, perchance? There we go. Finally. Can't stop thinking about the android body. I wonder if they finished developing those. <laughs> Sensor turret, antenna, a cool gun, retractable, laser eye, carbon fiber. Another thing that I just remembered, they had like little blind boxes of like uh, like, af like science turrets with like fucking skins and stuff on them. I wish they made those again. It's been like fucking ten years, but I need, I want more. I only ever got three like at the first convention that I ever went to. The 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 the, the CSGO, the CSGO turret skins. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Ah, oh, shit's breaking. Oh, there's the spot. There's the base of the spire. All right. You could tell. I mean, it's a it's a big. Oh, big I thought you meant pillar. that piece. I thought you meant that single piece, that flaming piece that fell down. I see. Here's the real question: Did they make their own original song for this? For the end credits. <laughs> Probably not. Hmm. That isn't here. Yeah, Start GLaDOS's VA is a professional opera singer. True, she is a professional oh, opera singer. Oh, yeah. And she's also married to the, the voice sniper, actor yeah. of the sniper. Yeah. Oh, and cool. most and most male citizens in Half-Life 2. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he does the... Uh, he did, like, the fucking... You know, sometimes I dream about Cheney's. Cheney's is pretty good. What's even crazier to me is Medic's voice by Travis Touchdown. True. 
Robert Atkin Dan is like one of the few voice actors that like had like a generally oh, no. extensive. I believe this might be an old, dangerous teleportation experiment. He had a pretty extensive <laughs> track record the... afterwards. Mm -hmm. Aperture science, non-local matter displacement device. <laughs> Quite a mouthful, I know. Our team effectively dubbed it this Adds a bit of pizzazz to it, right? It was developed as a successor to the Borealis experiments in the 70s. <laughs> uh, I've never seen it before. They said it. They said the Borealis. I've still not seen it with my eyes. <laughs> they can't help Did themselves. <laughs> All right, do the Mega Man X wall wall jump thing. Wee, 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 wee. I like the thing that like you shot up and then it like pushed you sideways on a platform. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Portal and Half Life mods be like the Borealis, <laughs> like how fucking JRPGs are like Yggdrasil, the World Tree. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I want the Borealis to be shown on screen. It was just a, it's just a fucking shitty sailboat with the word Borealis on the side. I mean, they did show. They have actually shown a picture of what the Borealis looks like. Unfortunately, it's it's very well put together. It's a big boat. And then, isn't it like stuck in old opportune portal too? Yes. Well, no. Okay, oh no! So it was just it was just the dock. Yeah, just the dock. Yeah. Don't. Mm -hmm. We still have we still haven't seen the we still haven't seen the Borealis in person in game. Mm -hmm. Oh no! Here, I just gotta do it like this. Let's find a way up to the surface. Yeah, that That's say. where we'll find the control room. Be, Be my, my Valentine. Valentine. Yo, guilty gear rep. Just kidding. Legs. <laughs> Did you know that if you just put a little bit of metal on the bottom of some plastic shoes, all fall damage negated? <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Many are saying this. This doesn't say need hug. Oh, there again. Yeah, I need, I need a, a hug. hug. <laughs> Don't worry, Orange. I'll I'll drive over there and give you a hug. Damn. All right, dude. Hell yeah. Now let's see how long the trip will take. <laughs> Probably a good chunk of time. Oh. A few hours at least. Mm -hmm. Where are you? Just on Just row all the way over Lake Ontario. <laughs> Somewhere in There's Ontario. There's a land connection near Rochester, <laughs> I'm pretty like sure. Just <laughs> jump over Niagara Falls. Why is the game calling you out like this? Damn, alright. <laughs> this will sound stupid, so just bear with me. Okay. Garbage disposal tubes generate much more force than the ones in test chambers. Should be able to carry you. Okay. If you jump into this tube, I will route you through to the upper layers of the facility. Ah. Uh. Jump in like the garbage you want. Woo! Oh, it's a me, Mario! Ha 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 ha! Fuck! <laughs> Fuck you! You fucking dick! And if you do drugs, you go to hell before you die. Oh, thanks. Thanks, Captain Lou. <laughs> Wait, you go to hell before you die? What says it in the commercial? Mean? It's machete, isn't it? That was legitimately something said by Captain Lou Albano in a commercial as Mario. Oh yeah, that one. Sorry, I'm going to research this spire thing while you solve the chambers. Is this mod of like the full portal game? If not longer. There's been chapters, but it's not quite as long. It's like it's a bit shorter. I mean, it's definitely longer than Portal One at the very least. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You can beat that shit in a fucking session. You can beat it in ten minutes, in fact. Okay, I'm not. I'm. I'm fast, but I'm not that fast. <laughs> but I thought you were literally Sonic the Hedgehog. What I'm the not fuck? Literally Sonic the Hedgehog. World record for fastest game of Portal. Uh, about six minutes. Mm -hmm. They got it down to six minutes? Holy shit. Oh, no, it's actually up to 550. <laughs> what's the clip? He's from the 80s, so 20 megabytes is huge. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what's the glitchless record? 
Let's find out. Glitchless. We're talking 14 minutes, 29. Wow. That's so crazy. Oh, wow. Well, I remember back... I read up on the spy. One thing uh, me. How did it inbounds. Uh, 8 minutes, 16. Oh, yeah. You, you can do some crazy shit with the fucking movement in Portal 1. Really upset it. I remember there was a big thing with a video called Portal Gun Pro of a guy beating it in 10 minutes. Mm. Ah, I guess it got it down even further since. The Whoa. funny tube. Yeah, but if you're moving out of bounds, almost 6 minutes. Yeah, no, the sense. funny that tube. That was weak out of bounds and everything. Okay, so let's see, I only got... 4 more for this portion of the game, anyway. Oh, it's the edgeless diversity sphere. Wait, is that Ratman text? Uh, I don't know. It just said next test. test. Oh. I'm sure the guy who made that cube, I'm sure the guy who made that edgeless diversity cube isn't very fond of edging. Roger. Edge. I'm sure whoever recorded that dialogue for Catherine really liked edging. <laughs> <laughs> oh, clever! Oh, do you have to take the. No, like we're just over to... the second test was, is part of the pre the previous testing chamber. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Did we drop it all like oh? What? Yeah. Well, why did you say it exactly like that? We. Just, just can remember. I, can I drop myself in the goo shoot? Oh. If I you can't... ever want a world record speed Boy. run, oh. just invent your own category. True. Any uh, percent while eating a specific while while eating a specific brand of chips, you, well, did, you can only get Riley. No else. Once the once the once the Baldur's Gate uh tactician chips only a Starian only chips this percent. Like what is a star? Like you just play as Starian only. Starian. Probably yeah. yeah. No items. Final destination. A solo. You would be surprised how easy it is. Okay, it's not. So okay, here's the thing. The, the the current best Baldur's Gate 3 speed run to my remembrance uh the sex percent for Baldur's Gate 3 is under 2 minutes. <laughs> well, they know, but is it is it patched or unpatched? Uh this is pre-patch 4. Yeah. Uh, patch 4 plus is under 5. <laughs> yeah. But the, okay, oh, who who are they managing who are they managing to bet Lazel? I don't know. Lazelle is currently the fastest one, actually. Is it really that easy to get her respect? Just murder yes. some people. Like a lot of it yeah, is genuinely Lazelle. just being a just being a piece of shit, basically. Yeah, it's Lazelle. Mm -hmm. <coughs> you can tell because they what they put all they put a lot of effort into her romance. <laughs> I thought it was just because you just need to kill some people. And then she's gonna be all over you. Mm -hmm. Maybe, maybe bring the portal higher up so it'll get closer to the goo. Well, nice. Like what up I am vertically. Do is uh, go back over here really quickly, so I can get a lot more room now. I don't oh, think yeah, you need as much room. Yeah, but this is funner. More fun. Wow, Ooh. this guy managed to. He rank all of Ultra Kill Act 2 in under 12 minutes. Wow. Oh, shit. But I was gonna say, wow. uh, the current, like, I think, like, current patch Baldur's Gate 3, one of the best speedruns that I saw was, like, 30 minutes. <laughs> Have you been was... playing nothing but Baldur's Gate for the past oh, week? Oh, no, uh, I just changed my, I just changed my currently playing, so that, I just changed my fucking status, so it says that I'm always playing Baldur's Gate 3. <laughs> oh, you bitch. I thought it'd be funny. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> uh, here we go. Now I can get even more <laughs> speed. Ooh! Yep. There it was again. Did you see? Not the really. Spire is stealing resources from down here as part of its power-up sequence. I don't think it presents an immediate threat to us, but. 
Something just feels. I mean, odd. I imagine if it's like stealing Alistair resources. Likes to poke around at anything, no matter how dangerous it is. No shit. The fact they Do you remember the Mantis Men? Doesn't really fill me with emotions I would categorize as positive. You were able to fucking put emotions into AI cores. <laughs> I mean, yeah, that's what that's what the point was. I think. But the mantis. Did you know that Aperture simulates breathing and blinking in its sentient robot? <laughs> oh boy. Breathe and blink my eye. Hey, they, they, uh, <laughs> they addressed it. <laughs> they addressed it. <laughs> Be glad you didn't volunteer for our early mind mapping tests. Those were not good times to be a test subject. <laughs> See, Rindy, they know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Orange, there's actual, like, things of Mantis Man. They're only available for in LEGO Dimensions. <laughs> you can only... Nope. It didn't exist until Portal 2. Stop it! <laughs> what? No. Unrelated. You wouldn't want to know what happened to Black Mesa. <laughs> No, it's the cum! <laughs> they can't help themselves! You wouldn't believe! You wouldn't believe what happened to Black Mesa! <laughs> Why wouldn't they want to know about what's going on? <laughs> look, 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 Glad I said it once during the song. That's all you need. Anything else He's... is overkill. <laughs> I mean, isn't Black Mesa like Aperture's direct competitor? Yeah, but also Black Mesa isn't uh, full of a direct of direct competitor and I said Aperture was a competitor. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, got, considering they, they talk get... about Black Mesa here, but never talk about Aperture in Half Life. So they don't give up. <laughs> I think by I think the implication is by the time Black Mesa happens, Aperture's already kind of on its like on its last mm -hmm. legs. It's probably fucking like it's probably just been like annihilated by by Glados at that point. I mean, in Portal One, everyone's pretty much already dead. Mm -hmm. In Portal Two, it's like thousands of years later, maybe. It's unlikely. Orange, maybe you're, yeah. to, maybe you're supposed to shoot the goo out of that panel and then have the tube suck it uh, up. Yeah, that makes sense. In a way, you could say Aperture actually technically outlived mm -hmm. Black Mesa. Not it's one, one one robot and one human. <laughs> one weird trick they don't want you to know about. <laughs> Maybe it's the. Oh the no! White see, cube? like it, it, it like uh. It, it makes it go up. It makes it go higher. Yeah. Maybe it's the white stuff you're supposed to shoot. You raise me higher. Oh, and then you just put it in there. Ah, what? Oh, nah, I thought maybe it would lead somewhere. Oh, yeah, no, that I don't think go. that's going anywhere, yeah. Oh. Yeah, no. There we go. See, this is the cum puzzle. We found it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, see, I know what we gotta do here. Alright, yeah. Yeah, I'm start it's starting to form in my mind, too. It's percolating. It's coalescing, even. Other buzzwords. Ludonarrative dissonance. <laughs> More like... Pluto. You can put them in the ground there, Will. You can say Pudo narrative oh, no, no, they're not. No. But now that you said it... I don't know. If you use the blue goo, does it make it Bluto narrative dissonance? Yeah, that you Thanks. see? We got it! We got it, everybody! <laughs> we got there. Alright, and then we just have one, like, right here. And then we just put one right there, and I think we're good. Let me just make sure this is a little bit more centered so it doesn't fucking fall over or some shite. There we go. Yeah. Uh, Whee! <laughs> what the fuck? Nickled it. You need to. Uh, you need to. You want to. Maybe a little. Maybe more bring it. Do, do, maybe bring no. it lower. Maybe bring it lower. I guess lower probably sounds. Uh, yeah, well, there's no. You can paint the. Yeah. See, there we go. You can paint the. Whee! There you go. Ba boing. <laughs> the boring solution. Shazam sure, cheaper solution. Because you, I, I was thinking about something else. 
Ah, I've seen shoot, uh, shoot out of the one below you and then bounce off the wall opposite of you. Ah, I, uh, most of it probably were. I see. <laughs> I like how they give you a fucking No. Subject. So you have just completed a oh. Congratulations on contributing once again. Oh. <laughs> She's embarrassed. <laughs> Nobody likes to hear themselves talk. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Unless you're a voice actor. <laughs> Wrong. No, the little mini voice actors think they sound horrible. Looks like I turned myself off. Yeah. I dabbled in voice acting when I first joined the company. Oh my fucking god! That was so long ago. Please, just forget everything you heard down there. Okay. Gar. Wow, she sounded so authentic when she talked about being a voice actor. I don't know if this is supposed to be a test chamber. If it is, <laughs> our chamber budget has officially hit a new low. Lar. We're running out of room for chambers. This is, this is one of those paint the entire room with cum puzzles. Yeah, it's the cum puzzle! <laughs> See, I told you the cum puzzle would be real. Get ready for a cum puzzle. Just like the One Piece. <laughs> it's real. Just like one piece. You can just like put the blue one anywhere and like keep spewing more and more yeah, and covering in more new areas. Imagine oh. imagine eating a little guy a devil fruit that just makes you a cum person. That sounds awful. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, mm. You already are a cum mm. person technically. Yeah, a singular cum person. Mm. What if you made of multiple cums? <laughs> well, what do you mean multiple cums? It would just question. be a mass of cum you would be, you would be, in human be shape. Human be, imagine being a slime girl, but instead of slime, it's cum. Oh, you I'm need to sure. reverse the blue one. You need to reverse the blue one. Mm -hmm. Here, can I, like... Is there any way that I can, like, hit it from, like, a different angle? Right, crouch. Does crouch jumping even work in this version of Source? Mm, kinda. Oh, no, see, like, it hard locks into that position once mm -hmm. you put it there. Wait. Yeah, there you go. Wait. What? I'm not sure See, now put the red one there. It's, it's slate now. So put it, put it, okay, put it on the angled one. The scant traces of sp but This one is already, like, portal juiced. Every part of those ask the author Whatever. bits at the end of One Piece is that it very quickly became, yes, everybody's devil fruit powers work on their dick. <laughs> it works on their entire body that includes the penis. <laughs> you don't need to keep asking. <laughs> Please stop asking about the Gomu Gomu what about, penis. <laughs> what about the dog with a gun? Is, is that, is... They still have not explained how a dog can become a gun. <laughs> well, exactly. no, they didn't explain the devil fruit. That the 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 gun is devil fruit. Uh, they they do something with science, the stuff, devil fruit, and now it's in the gun. Mm -hmm. Are they, so, like, are you well, talking about that thing where they can somehow force, they can somehow feed inanimate objects devil fruits? Mm -hmm. Yeah, like they they just have a sword that can turn into an elephant. Here, I need a little. I need a little bit more. Uh... The they gave him to the more. shittiest man in the world. That guy sucked. <laughs> he really is a shit, that one. I don't even remember what happened to him. Did he die? He probably got exploded. By uh, unfortunately, dream. not yet. Uh, it looked very much like he died when his spine was entirely snapped in half. Uh, but it turned out later he got better, and now he has to work for his, uh, for the guy that he was once his employee, and that's kind of embarrassing for him. I mean, we do know, if, not, not to go too deep into sports, but apparently they did figure out a way to give someone devil fruit powers without physically having them eat the fruit, just transferring the powers over. And the, and the, the fruit doesn't work anymore, but they didn't technically eat it or some shit. So maybe that's how they did it. It's very confusing. It's very confusing. Vegapunk, world's greatest scientist. Did a lot of fucked up stuff for the military, though. Gonna be real. Kind of. Pretty much all of them do. One. Pretty much all scientists do that. 
but they they make it a very good they point, like point you know. every other scientist was expressly evil except for him <laughs> Megapunk's just in it for the love of science. I sure he just want, and, and half of the time, the stuff he develops well, is objective. There's supposed to, to go over there. Yeah to, be, yeah, to be fair, a lot of the stuff he develops isn't necessarily, like, inherently bad. The world government just takes it and makes it fucked up. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Oh, you can get to your left. Oh. Oh, can you get over there? Yeah, let me just make sure it's a bit higher. Mm -hmm. See, now we're cooking. There we go. Don't think about how good that chapter of One Piece was a few weeks ago. <laughs> but was One Piece crazy good this week? It w well, no, it was uh, it this went, week. Oh. Well, I mean, yeah, it's, but it's like, the last one was pretty good. Uh, since about Christmas. Uh, we are due to find spoilers or raws for the next upcoming oh. chapter, possibly sometime next week. Uh, Sunday at the earliest. There's no way that's what you're supposed to do, but you read for Excel, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Okay, I think we we found the solution. Okay, hold on. I don't think you will find the solution, but if but if, whatever it is, it works. I, I it's a good enough, I guess. A punch can he add. saved. This was the correct solution. <laughs> he did it. I don't think it was, but correct solution. Yeah, sure, but sure. Hey, but if, sure. It, if if it works, it works. If it works, it works. Well. <laughs> You've never seen the, the Eric Andre there. model. It's too fast for eyes. <laughs> I don't think I want covering my eyes. I'm gonna be real. You're done in. You see. Can you splutter it over the other side, maybe? Like behind you? Okay, that's where it looks like you should be going. Like over there, where, where the gel is coming from over there. Yeah, I'm just trying to think about like. I need to get I need to get like the the optimal uh, I guess splatter point. Mhm. Mm the optimal optimal cum coverage. Oh shit. Go for it. <coughs> Especially cuz now I can do this. Wee. Oh. oh shit. Oh, there's gel over there. Mm -hmm. Just put put it where the gel is coming down. No, no, no. Uh, and you. Uh no, see. Oh no, it's not coming. Oh it's damn. It's going out of there, yeah. Uh, here. It's not mm. coming, it's going. Here, I think I need to like- I need to Are you losing this momentum? Just... No. Oh wow, I forgot how much Portal 2 cheats, holy shit. Oh yeah. Also... Yes. Made this cheat a little bit more. Oh, ah! <laughs> no! No! Are you sure? Maybe, I guess. How the fuck do the long fall boots break your fall without breaking your legs? Uh, science. science. Yeah. Don't so forget to bring the long fall boots. There's no time. Your sword is enough. What? When are we gonna? When are we gonna? When are we gonna straight up get the long fall boots in the moon blades? Or not? <laughs> because we can have another fall. That's so easy. Yeah, but yeah. but that, but now we but now I can but now at least you one can make can boots fall of feather fall. In fact, I'm certain that if you ask AC the... nicely enough, he could make those like overnight. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. What the heck is that thing? Oh. Protection. Uh, ninja info cards. <laughs> with, with the portal, see if it works. What yeah. you move? Yeah. Ah. Uh, Ring of Feather Falling is a thing in the in the basic handbook. Bada bing. This is not in can this does not work with the Lord Portal 2. In Portal 2 it works. Lord of Don't worry about it. Maybe it's intended. 
You know, I guess the better Actually, question no, is, can actually, no, this one it... shoot the moon? Oh, shit. <laughs> a good question, actually. That was such a hype moment in the, in the base game. Oh, cube! I need cube. Hi, oh. I got a piece of a relationship Let's in go. my mirror dungeon. Hi. <laughs> Wait, does anybody have that fucking I'm just imagining that one Evil Within right. 2 meme? Oh yeah, the c I don't, I'm, not, I'm not quite sure about a meme, but yeah, no, Evil Within 2 uh, is no notorious for its usage of, uh, of viscous fluids. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I was, gonna, I was gonna try to be a little more polite about it, but yes, no, it's just... I mean, it's supposed to be, it's supposed to be wax, but... Mm -hmm. You know, this this is is shoe doesn't act. Shoe doesn't act like quacks. This is my kingdom. Doesn't like come. it either. This is my kingdom come. We are so. You can have it like being not angled. We are so mature. True. I am a very mature. Oh, I see what to do. Okay. Magic go over here. Grab the boy. Sorry, they. Oh, it's the boy. Here comes the boy. Hello. I'm not exactly sure if that's what I had to do, but I mean, fuck, might as well. Anyways. Also, isn't it super dangerous to get covered in this stuff in universe? Yeah. Oh, shit, no! Oh boy. <laughs> That's fine. Oh. I'm okay. <laughs> Whoa! Oh! Oh, 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 that's. Mm. Welcome to Boundary I, Break! I discovered tech! <laughs> Ah, uh, I see. We gotta get up there, I think. I see it already. Here, let me see. There you go to get it all over. Mm -hmm. Slather it. Slather. Oh. Hmm. This is different. It's like r really messy. Like in Portal Two, when they had this sort of puzzle, they um. Oh yeah, like they they they, they had it always at an angle. Because, but in this one instead they just have it like, be really messy so it covers the whole area around you when you shoot it straight up. Uh, I was hoping, I, I was hoping it would hit that and then like ricochet me over towards the wall. Shit. <laughs> I think we're supposed to go on the, on the ventilation tunnel again, maybe? Mm, for chance. Makes sense. Oh, hey, it ah. Holy shit. There you go. Wait, was that actually, like, intentional? Oh, oh my god. Oh. I'm gonna do a- I'm gonna do a quick- I'm gonna do a save, just to be safe. <clears throat> oh! Eh. <laughs> Load. There has to be a way to get over there. Oh no, okay. 
Okay, I think I think we're overthinking this. I think this is just an extension of the of the thing directly below me. We. I think we better think of something. I'm thinking. I think we better think with portals. Now you're thinking with white wall goo. I think we gotta get out of here. At least it gave me time to disable the speakers in the next chambers. We don't need to listen to that again. I think we need to listen to that again. Voice actor. <laughs> Hello, everybody, and welcome to Behind the Meme. That looks more like a chamber. You know what? I actually remember this one. It's collected some dust, but looks pretty much unchanged. Most of our tests get updated when we find a critical design flaw. Seems like this one survived the test of time. Mm. Seven of eight. Okay. You walk. You walked into the echo audio trigger. Mm -hmm. Oh, I can't use that one. Shit. Mm -hmm. hmm. Oh, curious. Okay. All right, what can we do here? Wow, this is a hell of a chamber. Ah, that turns it off. Okay. Hmm. Uh. Oh, that turns uh. off the death grid. Okay. So we got cube. Oh. Oh. I, I take it the kill chamber was like the, the kill grid was also a cutting uh, a cut thing. For chance. For chance to dream. Uh, no, it's to think. The music is unusual. To for chance to meme. For chance to dream. This this is very much not portal sound. Mm -hmm. It's cool, I like it though. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This reminds me of a track that I'd fucking hear in Fata Morgana. <laughs> nice. Let me see it, let me this. Oh, wait. Up here, come the techno. Mm -hmm. Oh, there we go, hold up. I mean, yeah, the only problem is the negation field, and I can't do anything with that. Oh, this is a doozy. Well, actually, there is a- wait, there's a port- there's a box over here as well, actually. Hold on. Uh, uh, okay, here we go. Was that thing just standing on air for a second? No. I mean, that's probably- that's what happens when you open up something really, really fast. Oh, yeah. It's fucking Looney Tunes. <laughs> Type the... beat. Oh! You sucked it out. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, at least it's working. Just the way God intended. Where do you need to go? That's a great question. We'll figure that out later. Can I see where it takes? Uh, not at the moment. Yeah, let's go find out. Like, fo follow the time? Uh... Well, oh, at the very, oh, very, least, very, least, yeah, at the very <laughs> least, we know it died. <laughs> okay, wait, hold up. Let me go. You don't actually need the cube there anymore. Well, no, because the, I, need to be able to, I need to get through here because I want this. Oh, I guess. Still. I guess. Because then I can put this one uh, here. I think. It might not necessarily have enough suction power, but I guess it's worth a shot. Well, no, but it. Hmm. Ah, yeah, no, there's no fucking way. But also, it, it would lead to the pipe and then get destroyed. Does that, enough, yeah. does that kill- does that kill only you, or does it kill everything? Okay, so here, for starters... Yeah, here, we can probably get rid of this one for right now. Hmm. I think the problem is the button. 
because I need to be I need to turn that one off as well. That that's those yeah, that's an emancipation grid, so that would get rid of the cube that I already have is the problem. Well that's one of the problems. We have a lot of those recently. Uh but the other issue is I need to be able to send that cube down and I can't with that there. Because I need to be able to push that button there. Like I can set up a portal, the only problem is I can't like it won't stick because this is gonna get rid of the old one. Oh, and this actually resets it. This changes it, too. Well, more than that, I can't even... Yeah. Okay. So I think I'm a little too early for that bit. Hmm. This suction device has to go somewhere. I'm very curious where, actually. Because I'm guessing there's a, that, that's probably a part of the puzzle that I'm just kind of missing at the moment. So, let's test it and see where it goes. Okay, and... Oh! oh. It goes there. There you go. Now I see. How are we going to get the portal through the kill barrier? Hmm. Well, see, I guess the I mean, question is what purposes that actually serve. I mean, do you want... I mean, if you, actually, I'm perfectly fine if you want to give me hints for this one. Or I mean, this idea. looks like... Like, the per the orange beam might catch it when oh, it yeah, through. Yeah. Mm -hmm. like... Now you're thinking with orange gravitational beams. Like or I do happen to have an orange gravitational beam at home. What the fuck? Why would you share it? It's kind of hard to do that. You don't live near me. So here, we can set this one up over here now. Alright. Now we're and cooking then, with ass. Oh, wow, careful. Oh. And then this disables the kill field. Mm -hmm. Alexa, kill! Field. Okay, well, yeah, here, hold up a second. Let me get back up there first. <laughs> so we okay, I think they're supposed to take that. Take the red portal, put it down there, and it'll and it'll float you across to the door. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Just take this cube and put it on the button that yeah, triggers the beam. You mm -hmm. roll, Reggie. You always go all the way over there, but there's a white yeah, surface right here. It, it hit me as I was doing that. <laughs> now you're thinking with cubes. I have fought with cubes in the past. You ever just... I love Petras. You ever just think? No. Well, me, I was just thinking. Contrary. I found it unnecessary as time went on. Mm -hmm. I like the I like the sound effect. It sounds like it's going into water. Yeah. Good news. I found us an elevator out of here. Just one more chamber. Oh boy, I don't like the way those, those screens are looking at me. Mm -hmm. Okay, second to last chamber for this part of the game, at least. Last chamber. The surface elevator is right after. Oh boy. Just don't look down. Oh, we're down doing one of these ones. That shaft goes all the way to the bottom. We're doing one of the big, one of the big launchy ones, my favorites. Don't forget, 
The progenitor to this game is Prey 2006. Well, okay, not this game. The progenitor to the original Portal is Prey 2006. For real? Yeah, uh, a lot of the, there's a lot of the uses of like Portal technology in that game that ended up getting reused by the guy who made it into Portal. Really? That's neat. Mm -hmm. What? What uh, do you mean? In Prey 2006, there's a lot of like uh, they use a lot of like transitionary portals that take you from one part of the arena to another part of it. Mm -hmm. Like another part of the area to another bit. And the guy who made that technology, like, in that game, transposed it into Portal. Mm. But, like, Portal had, like, a precursor. If they developed the evolved sign and got the people who made it to make Portal. Yeah. yeah, he was on the development team. But that development team made a completely different, like, an indie, a small indie game, like, the, like in college. Oh, you're talking about, about like, Portal uh, Flash game? Hold on a second. No, no, that's unrelated. There's like a, a, an early like 3D game that they made. Looks very really trash. It's about like a princess with no knees. Oh. And she uses Portal to get her out because she can't jump. Uh, hold on a second. I forgot what, what it was called. No, back you drop. There you go. Get back now, y'all. I could have swore I remember hearing some shit about like how Hmm. Huh. Yeah. <coughs> it was the Game ah. senior game project to a bunch of people and well just and Gabe Newell saw them and oh, hired them to make Portal. Yeah, never mind. I remember hearing that the guy who went to go the, like the one of the guys who worked on that like went on to do stuff for that. But okay, yeah, my bad. I miss her. I heard wrong then. It seems. Okay, I think I'm gonna have to take a little bit of a leap of faith here with this one. Or I can just do that. Woo! Don't, don't do that again. Nah. Ah. Say, please. You're gonna give me a heart attack. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine if it just works. Oh, ow. Ah, light bridge. Okay. Okay, yeah, I, could, I, could, I probably should have figured that wasn't gonna quite work. Let's try that again. Ah, mm -hmm. oh, wait, shit. Oh. Ah, no! <laughs> Alright, I guess I don't even need the fucking light bridge then here. Who even needs a light bridge, really, if you think about it? True. I'm always saying this. Like, they're like jetpacks and air bikes. Like, yeah, they exist. They're just for rich people. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I think you can say that about most things that they're that, that people generally try to market towards the rich and wealthy. One second, I'm gonna go get some coffee. Okay. At 11 p.m. <laughs> Probably from like listen, the kitchen. Listen, I woke up at 4 p.m. today. Yeah, you'd still be pretty awake. <laughs> All I'm saying is, like, I, I, I gotta unfuck my sleep schedule. Uh, I see. With delicious toffee. Coffee, not toffee. Well, it could be a toffee-flavored coffee. Mm. It is true. He's true. not wrong. That sounds awesome. I wouldn't scoffy at some toffee coffee. You can maybe, like, make a portal with a bridge and then go through it. Mm -hmm. There's not a lot of services for me to work. Oh, wait a minute. Over here. Yeah. 
almost died there for a second. So let's see then, I need to find a place that I can shoot one back, I think in there. And up to the above it, maybe? No, like inside that room, above the vent. Nah, it's all glass. I, I sure I think there's an upper panel that isn't is covered. Like if you go near the cube. Yeah, hold on a second. Is this that Arthur? <laughs> That's me. That's good old pets. Mm -hmm. Nice. <laughs> Tragic. Okay. Like, can you not shoot up there? Up there. Hold on. <clears throat> hey, I can't shoot over here. Hey, what the fuck? This is glass. No. It's next. Huh. I wasn't able to do that, do that before, I don't think. That or I'm just forgetting. You can shoot through these too. Hmm. Huh. So admittedly, the only problem with that is then if I were to do that, I would fall to my death. Hmm. I am curious what happens well, if... Uh, yeah, may maybe. Maybe your idea earlier was right. Mm -hmm. But you need to make the other end of the portal there. I see, like, okay, so my question is it's gonna give me a lot of momentum, but a lot of momentum to do what? Because I'm just gonna land, like. But, but, I mean, you don't necessarily need momentum, you just need to get to touch the portal to get to the other side. Mm -hmm. Like, we just put the red one above the vent up over in the white panel over there. Oh, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Here, I see what you mean. Okay. Let's see, let me just, uh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Hey, so, yeah, just do that with the cube, I guess. Wait, no, but you need the cube for that. Well, no, mm. but this also spawns. Oh, this is a different area. Uh. Oh. And then it should. Oh, wait. Drop right yeah, there you go. Hey, there you go. go. We're just cubing around. Good puzzle, I like that. Just some funny guys with some wacky cubes, that's all. We've done this before, so be ready to catch me. We're becoming quite good at this. Elevator is right through here. Quite cozy. I'm sure we can stuff ourselves in there. Never thought I'd miss the car park. We're almost out of here. To be fair, I'm sure I'm sure that the person who you used to be is probably missing breathing oxygen at the moment. Um, uh, something something surface. deadly neuro neurotoxin. Oh, I found you. Oh hey. Was quite worried Let's do this one last time. You. Reach the we surface again. In a wall, so that's good. Tell you what, why don't you come back and join me here in the spire? Charging up the teleporter as we speak to continue our mission, you so rudely interrupted. What mission? Oh, who's your little sidekick? Cute. You can join us if you want. Join you? With what? We just want to repair the facility. I will pick up the remains of our former central core, reassemble her, and bring her back to life. Wait, who are you talking about? Are you talking about GLaDOS? You want to bring back GLaDOS? That's what the humans call her, yes. Uh, oh no. <laughs> that is why you gotta switch your capacitors. So that's the sort of guys you normally hang out with. <laughs> you work with him? <laughs> oh, I shouldn't have looked. Oh, solid ground at last. 
Put me on the rail over there. I'll open the door for you. Uh, alright. Rail? Rail? I mean, if only you could use her to break all this broken glass. Uh, I'm having trouble seeing it. There's the rail. Right, so you're the one who activated the spire. I... I should have seen that coming. Is he really trying to bring back GLaDOS? He's right about one thing, though. The facility is already oh, barely it. holding together. <laughs> And that won't change unless we put oh, someone it's night time. in charge of nice. the central core. Mm. But why her? I'm why his progress. Oh! Oh! That's neat. Oh, that's okay. cool. New mechanic. I like <laughs> new mechanic. New mechanic. Fun. Hey, you notice that the lasers emit, like, music? A little bit, yeah. Oh. Right. Wait, what, what, do you know what activates the door in them? It's that. Oh. I couldn't see through the Discord stream. You can just, like, go through the portal with it, you know? Eh, this is more fun. Oh, is, the, is the Discord stream bad for you? I can re reduce the quality. No, no, it's fine. It's just like dark areas like that. They didn't collide with the receptor there. She did. I mean, neither did I. But the records are disturbing. I'm surprised she kept Could records of that. a second to seal the fate of every human in the enrichment center. Would she not? I never understand why we gave her that neurotoxin. <laughs> <laughs> Me neither. <laughs> Never Common this. aperture L. Okay, that is a, that's a pretty good point. Oh, I see. Now we just gotta find out where the, which cube is the one that's generating the laser. Found it. <laughs> <laughs> oh. What? What? Wait. What happens? If you, can you? Oh, that's is this cool. Like, is this like so go, go put this cube into this other laser. Put this cube into the, the same laser. Oh. No. Oh. Okay. <laughs> oh. Double laser. Oh, that's cool. It's even crazier when it works. <laughs> Three. I just, I just wish I could go back. You know, I wish that I could turn back time. If you could turn back time, would you find a way? Maybe? I don't know. Oh, I see. So that makes the door. Alright. Uh, wait a minute. Oh. Fuck. I took that. Surely, hold on. What? What if I get a little bit funky with it? Hold on. Can I get a little what bit funky you're... with it? Can you make an endless loop? Like, what happens if you turn this first cube in, into, into the first one? Uh, unfortunately, it does not seem like anything happens. Damn. Wait, no, actually, no, go to the first one, like, turn it, start turning it around. It just turns it on. That's so weird. I'm just loose, like the, uh, you can just like turn off the portal and then turn it back on again when, after you get on the platform. Oh yeah, of course. That's a much better idea. The blue one is slightly off, I think. Oh, yeah, 
Like the wrong spot? Ah, yeah, come. Hey, good job. Four out of seven. Oh, this is just a regular one. Normal one, yeah. <laughs> oh. Boring one. Oh, yeah, yeah let's go. <laughs> I, want a cheese I actually really like this mechanic. Mm -hmm. It's a really cool mechanic. Temporal lasers. We might not see each other in the next test chamber. Whatever he says or has already said to you, we can not allow GLaDOS to return. Alright, this one doesn't have the jiggle bone because it's not as broken. This one's actually like put together. Mm -hmm. Are they gonna go through this effort to try and wake up Glados and accidentally and accidentally wake up Whitling instead? I just wanna say thank you. I wonder. I can't help but feel like there's a little bit of cynicism behind that. Thank well, I don't know. Sounds honest to me. Good old honest mids. <laughs> ah, this turns on the thing. Hmm? What's the other course today? My little command. Sterling. No, the other one. Oh. I think. Maybe. Don't quite remember. <laughs> Ashley's detestable neutral skip. <laughs> There's a sterling honest neutral. <laughs> you know how hard it is to approach a woman that has an that has an undetectable flash kick. <laughs> Oh, here, I think I need to put a better portal down so that I can access this a little bit easier. Hold on. Yep. Oh, whoopsies. Oh, I mean, I have to come back up there anyway. So let's see, I just gotta remember to put down the blue one that I'm going up there. Oh. Ugh, I gotta get this one back then. Shit. Oh, wait, hold on a second. Oh, wait, you can see through there, can't you? Hold on. Not in the way that I would have hoped, though. Oh, wait, hold on. Uh. <gasps> uh our uh, oh. our other core is Conley. Conley, that's right. and mount it back into the first one. Mm -hmm. Just like, put it here. Oh yeah, well not here. I just need to make sure that I have a way to get back up here once I set this one back down. Hmm. The problem is I don't really have an easy access way to hit that portal. Wait, did you try looking up? That is that is the sky. <laughs> uh. Like you can put the the second cube in, into this laser again, and then we come to the first one again. Oh yeah, you're right. Before you say anything, I am going to accept. Implicit apology for breaking the teleporter. I didn't break the teleporter. Oh, this really caused a lot of havoc there. I didn't don't do worry, that intentionally. I'm not add the repairs to your list. I already got that covered. I don't think you do. Hey, I've got a question. Your new little blue friend. Uh -huh. Who is she? The voice seems familiar. Oh, are you also a member? Oh, maybe. 
It was like a janitor or something that they uploaded. Oh, thanks. Oh, I see. I need to get back over there. Oh, there we go. Oh, I'm gonna have to be fucking extra cool about this. <laughs> Alrighty, then. Uh, whoop. Let's go! Nice. Oh. Fantastic. We're not doing very rarely requires you to be cool about stuff. Mm -hmm. You almost never actually need to make a portal while you're flying. <laughs> wow. How can you enjoy this? That's the mage. <laughs> they did nothing wrong. Just because they were going to shoot you to death. Wow. Why are you using juice? <laughs> oh wow. That doesn't oh. sound safe. <laughs> using oh, the boy. using the asbestos juice, I don't think that helps. <laughs> Sorry, the moon asbestos juice, very different. And that makes sense though. Mm -hmm. Like the moon gel is what like could what's conducive to portals. Yes. If we can go into the control room and cut power from the core, we have a real chance of preventing a catastrophic meltdown. Okay, I see how it is. Good gravy. <laughs> Woo! Oh, I didn't think that worked. Oh, we got wet. Water. <laughs> this is like a theme park. <laughs> they're using all. They're using all the gimmicks. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so let's see. Uh, number one, probably want to get those. Uh, number two, where do I go from here? I'm feeling it. Uh, fuck. Hold on. Yeah, let me just get out. With this fucking rain and and like air coming out from the shop, like a rainforest. Unnamed character, you have to get out of here before they blow up the facility with you along with it! Blows up! <laughs> ah, I see what we gotta do. Hold on. Oh, well, hold up. <laughs> Boom. Hmm? Hey! Ah, uh, there's the goo. Goo on! And there's goo! How can you say your day's you going by without a little bit of goo in it? Oh, I understand what I gotta do. Hold up. Ah. Uh, Probably want to get rid of- oh, oh. Well, no, the thing is, there's too much velocity, so I can't yeah, yeah. actually put it there, yeah. Mm -hmm. Hmm. So maybe I do just gotta- oh, wait, I can just put myself back through the, through the thing again. Mm -hmm. This time I'll jumpy. Alright. What? Okay. Uh, whoop. Oh. <laughs> I was hoping that would work. Drat. Ah, fuck. Mm -hmm. I needed to make sure I hit it. <laughs> ah! Damn it. And then a 
boink. Boop. There we go. Chojan. Hey, no. Dojan. Chakang. Oh, the chat of the rain. Oh, and now I have goo control. Houston, we have goo control. <laughs> this is a major time to goo control. Ah, my goo! <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, okay. I, I wasn't sure where I put that, but I don't mind. I'm stepping through the goo. That was one of the last things that David Bowie said. <laughs> oh wait, no! Oh, I, got yeah, it. I... I had to crouch, I had to crouch. Take your protein pills. Eat your goo. <laughs> Okay. Goo button. Probably Release the goo. Probably don't want to goo the cubes, though. Mm. Do you think that gooing the cubes will make the cubes uh, undoable? You can just put the gel into the vent. Perhaps even ungooable. In fact, there, it looks like there's a panel specifically made for that. Wait a... Uh... Over to the left. <laughs> Cusco's poison. Poison for Cusco. There you go. More like Goosco. <laughs> oh, I got it. What, 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 huh? My, my mistake. Why? My mistake. I was, I Big was boings. So, I was so trained to do that at that point. <laughs> <laughs> my fucking hyena dog brain kicked in. Alright, this time I won't put a portal there. No, 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 no. What do you mean? Ah, fuck. Okay. Um Oh, wait, Do you on. think if dogs yeah, evolved just, just like people, would they still have trampolines? Mm -hmm. Okay, so yeah, yeah, I can, I can get the cube over there. I think I just need to make sure that they're that the, the 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 portal's in a place where it'll actually like. Land if who like, evolved drive. like people? Dogs. Why, why, why are you doing? You should just take. Can't you take the cube? Wait, you just probably. Oh, yeah, I guess I could. Yeah, true. That's probably a good idea. Here. Oh, look, a cube. That's a funny cube. You can take it with you. I can take the cube with me. <laughs> I can see. It's like why cube. You can I use outside. What? I, I mean, that works, I guess. Wait, did that? Did it didn't remove. <laughs> I guess the feet did. Yeah, no. The f I guess the physics messed up a bit no. when the cube hit you. Uh, you see, that's probably why they made it so the laser doesn't deal any damage to you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now you're thinking with laser cubes. Let's meet off this elevator. <laughs> okay. I'll now you're thinking with portal cubes. That will take us straight to the spire. Portals? Meet you there. Cubals? Corals? The remote execution. Kringle. <laughs> so, I have decided. Okay. You betrayed me. Twice. I have given you <laughs> chances. It tells me that your new little friend managed to turn you against me, so I'm just going to kill you now <laughs> before you become any sort of threat again. Thank you for. I have a gun that shoots portals. Well. Now you might be thinking, but Sterling, Sterling, my dear. No, 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 D don't do that. Where are you going? <laughs> Probably has a long down going on. Oh, here we go, lore, Sterling lore. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, I can't see you. I built a vacuum cleaner once. 
Oh, not even a person. Where do you think you're going? But he's a janitor, kinda. Mm. Oh, I thought I thought she meant like literally jumping, and I was about to about to tell her uh, tell her some choice words. Thankfully, that does not seem to be the case. Uh oh, okay. Yeah, just fucking pop that bitch over there. Woo! <laughs> Now Nailed I it. Look. Well, now I look stupid. Oh. Meet you inside. Okay. <laughs> she put AI in a vacuum cleaner and then shoved it into a personality core. I don't. I, mm, I wonder if she did it. But, mm, oh, looks like some stuff weren't done according to protocol. Mm. Oh, wait, I saw. You think there was protocol? I think they thought about what they were Protocol doing. was money, yeah. please? They, they Do you got guess. some? I don't think That's they ever... crazy. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> After science doing whatever the fuck they want. I don't, I, yeah. I don't think they ever thought about the repercussions of any of the things they were doing. Why do you think sure. It's looking for anything they can shove into a core. Like, sure, <laughs> it was meant to be the, like, the record of, a, I put of some a girl who works nice here. <laughs> This, this one ought to be funny. <laughs> this one really likes space. <laughs> this one's voiced by Nolan North. So, like, okay, this is this raises the question. So, Sterling is just a vacuum cleaner. So, what was the space core before they shoved it into a core? Uh, like a telescope or some shit? Good question. Uh, a 24 hour marathon of the sci fi channel condensed into a little boy. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say Discovery, but no, that's. Discovery is not. That's about animals. They don't care about space. They do space sometimes. They do space some. Okay, they do space, they do space sometimes. <laughs> Alright. The space sphere was apparently inspired by an advertisement for the Oregon Coast Aquarium. I didn't even intend to. Cool. <laughs> oh boy. Ah, uh, the epic death murder pit, my favorite. Ah uh, yes. Turret hell or Android <laughs> Hell. Android Hell is a real place that you will be going to. <laughs> maybe maybe higher? Maybe maybe higher? Yeah. Let's let's take this and maybe not directly yeah, into maybe not directly into, into the the <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Woo! Ow. Ah, there we go. And didn't get melted by slag. It would have been fun. Good if job. I did, though. Oh. Hopefully this doesn't have a timer on it. We so, oh, so much hey! cheating! Oh my god! The, 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 oh yo! Oh, that's so clever! That's oh, good. I love that. That's that's good. Good. Uh, that was my uh, popped up of the incinerator. That's where I incinerated the companion up, yeah. cube earlier. Oh, uh, one of the incinerators. Come and grab me. No rails in the chamber. Okay. You ready for this? Yeah, probably. Welcome, ladies. Welcome. To your demise. <laughs> Let's get the preamble and get to it. Any last words? Yeah, I have some. Is it possible that you were once a vacuum cleaner? Um, how, how do you know that? <laughs> I can't believe it. Oh, they grow up so fast. <laughs> it's not polite to murder your mother. <laughs> <laughs> but how is that possible? I was created by a human. I can't believe my Roomba is trying to kill me. <laughs> <laughs> this fire is still charging. Just give me a minute. I'll murder you as soon as possible. What did you this guy sounds like the nerd emoji. <laughs> Sterling petitions to change button? with the, the change button? with the... Big and red, right in front of us. That's not a button. I ignore it. Don't look at it. <laughs> what happens if we press it? Nothing. Don't press the button. It's really boring, believe me. I say we press it. Don't press it! Alright, before we press any buttons, can you put me on this claw in the corner? I have an idea. 
Hey, hey, no. <laughs> and where's the claw? Oh. Oh, thanks. <laughs> oh, it's the claw. I say we give that button a little push while I explore this mech. That's one satisfying button. I told you not to Oh, jeez. Oh, it's teleporting oh. in puzzles. Only be pressed by mm -hmm. authorized employees. I fired you, remember? That's it. Time to die. Okay. In your last moments, you'll die in 5 minutes. Can the fight's on. We need to disconnect oh. all of those pipes before the time runs out. Here, through this door. Okay. I solved the puzzling time, I guess. What are you doing? Do you really think that you can stop? Yeah, a little bit. What's this do? I... Whoa. Uh -huh. This is wobblier than I thought. Where is she? Find a way to get to this control room. Over there. Maybe ah, there you go. Oh. You look ridiculous. <laughs> now, inside. Come on, hurry. What do you expect to oh, find uh, in there? Think these chairs are gonna save you? No. Oh, just doesn't... a button light. What would you use the chairs for? I mean, I can ask you the same about the buttons. You seem a little bit obsessed with those. I can't believe my Roomba is trying to kill us. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, wrong button. Ah, eh, whatever. Fuck. Oh wait, hold on. Better idea. Oh, uh, we have three and a half minutes. Okay. Button. Yes. We're halfway there. Two more stations to go. Two more. I should have never taught you how to push buttons. <laughs> nice. That slowed the charge as well. Oh, cool. Some time. Come on out. Mm. Two more stages. Oh yeah, there's checkpoints. See. Next control nice. room is this way. Think you can get over somehow? That's a great no, question. Can't. Just give up trying. Nah, there's gotta be a way. You know what? Yes. I want to see you try. Come on, fall down that pit. Oh wow, they're asking me to get really <laughs> clever with some of these. We have to resolve the puzzle. <laughs> kind of. <laughs> oh yeah, that's cool. No, we, yeah. See, look, cause there's a little thing right there. Here, hold on. You're gonna have to progressively go through it again. But now there's more. All right, here we go. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, oh, I see what that did. All right. Uh, here, I need to move that just like a little bit more to the left. Okay, a little bit more up. Okay, don't do that. Uh, fuck. Oh, there we go. Probably need to probably need to angle myself up a little bit so I don't fucking get caught on the window. <laughs> oh wait, isn't that the same one that I already did? Can press up. Uh, I am. Uh, uh oh. I am physically stuck. That's eh, fine. Okay. Oh. Yeah, that's the one I already did. Whoopsies. Uh, here, let's see. Yeah. Can you press press it just in case? Well, actually, hold on a moment. Uh, here. It is red. Yeah, it's still glowing. You know, hold on a second. I want to. Don't you try pressing it at least? You gotta smash that like button. Well, that disables the that just that just turns off the the cube that I have over there. Should you not try to press the button at all? That button just in case. turns off the cube, and I'm gonna have to any I have to anyway now. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay, I'm just gonna reload from the checkpoint. <laughs> what was the most recent auto save? I'm gonna assume it was. You know what? Whatever. I'll just. I'll oh no. Give I'll give it a shot. It'll just reset. Oh look, a cube. Hey, look. Cube. Thank goodness someone left it there. It would have been such a travel to get all the way here and bring that cube. Oh, I needed to go over there. I was completely overthinking it. Hold on. There we go. I can probably do this part in a minute 30. A minute 20. <laughs> Marginally less time. Mmm, margarine. <laughs> 
Good. So, here you are. You're just back now. Is Marge short for Marjorie? Probably not. That why Homer married her. We used to do everything together. Do everything together. You were a vacuum cleaner. You cleaned up for us. Don't even ask me why we gave him consciousness. <laughs> no, that no, that's a really good question though. Why'd that's you do that? That's a really good question. Yeah. Seriously, what's happening? I built a vacuum cleaner with abandonment issues. <laughs> good bed. Good bed. <laughs> ah, fuck. Okay, hold on a second here. <laughs> He's in quite the murderers. The last control room is right here. Oh, good, Come that reset the timer. You can do this. No, you can't. Remember that brain damage test we did where you had to push a button? Turns out I was wrong. You must have brain damage. Why else <laughs> would you do this to me? Ah, uh, don't listen to him. He's kind of slept for that long, right? Right? Oh. Oh. Maybe that's why you don't talk. <laughs> Explains a lot. <laughs> <laughs> He's in quite the murderous mood today. Yeah, yeah, we're at the last end. We're at the, probably like the last couple of minutes. We'll just fucking finish it. <laughs> I mean, yeah, that's why I have a game. That's what. That's why I have a key. That's why I have a gaming keyboard. He's right. I'm not talking to you. <laughs> I'm not talking to you. <laughs> 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 Alright, where the? How the hell? Huh? Yeah, just get to four. Just get to four. Just get to four. Yeah, simple. Shrimple, even. Easy. Where was that uh, plate? Oh yeah, but can I access over here again? Not exactly. I mean, I kinda can. Do I have to do the whole puzzle Should again? you? <laughs> that, that seems to be the case. Oh, yeah, I guess that makes sense. <laughs> Alright. So we even got another cube and everything. Okay. <laughs> I think you need to have a portal set up, like... It, like, so the exit is, like, that, like, uh, angled one. See, then I just need to get a blue one over there, and I can land on top yeah. of there, and then, yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. Oh, wait, no, there's just one right there. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay, but I think you need to launch yourself, maybe. Like, fall, no, 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 oh, my, mm, okay, looks like that, this should work. Mm -hmm. I think you were supposed to, like, lift yourself up, and then fall down into the portal from up high. Oh, yeah, you did. Uh, yeah, that's not gonna work. Well, um... <laughs> I'm <laughs> time to look for Easter eggs. Just, let's, let's see, there you go. We just go that way. Okay. Alright, fine. It didn't like you doing that. <laughs> In my opinion, it's the Jedi who have brain damage. No, I say it's kind of ableist. <laughs> I don't think these guys have the concept of ableism. <laughs> Somebody should call HR I, on him. I really like how much fun she's having messing with him. Do you think there's an HR department here? <laughs> Maybe. It's it's like it's human. She's a the robot. HR department and it's a trap door that leads you into a pit. <laughs> these aren't these aren't humans. Ain't Charles couldn't do anything. Robot resources. <sighs> okay, just making sure. Yeah, 
I used the blue one to do that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh wait, no, that's a little too far away. Hold up. There we go. Just put the red one over there. There you go. Whee! Whee! Yep. There we go. Final button. It is quite pathetic that a button pusher is your arch nemesis. No offense to you, test subject. Oh, shit. <laughs> Oh god damn it. <laughs> no, those stairs aren't those stairs have holes in them. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh god, I'm gonna do that. Oh thank god. Nice. No offense to you, test subject. Just the reality of the situation. I'm not even gonna respond to that. Yeah. Oh. Nah, wrong one. Wrong one. Fuck. Ah, come on! Oh, God damn it! I don't have hands. It is quite pathetic that a button pusher is your arch nemesis. No offense to you, test subject. Just the reality of the situation. I'm not even gonna respond to that. How am I supposed to hit? How am I supposed to get to that one? <laughs> Oh, you wait, can there's maybe. There's gel. There's gel. Hold on a second. There's gel. Okay. There's there's a gel thing, but there's no actual gel there. Maybe you can drop another turret on it. Oh, yeah, true. Maybe. Oh, yeah. There's, there's, you can make an infinite loop. Oh wait, no. There's just there's just one oh, there. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Jeez, all right. Unless they run into gunfire. It's quite pathetic. It's just the reality of the situation. Hello. It fucking shut on me. Oh, I see. I gotta get momentum going. Oh, we're falling. Okay, fine. Hold on. Oh, it has to be a little bit lower. There's a thing right there. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. God damn it! Keep consistent! Oh. I hate it here. <laughs> That is, that's way too far away. Can you not like jump another from the bridge to that? Not quite now. No, no, like land on the bridge over there. And then jump inside there. I like now you can position. No, but position properly though. Oh, oh. yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah, I know what I got you. There you go. Fun. Yes, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, a little bit. Look, we also want the best for Apache. I don't. I want to go home. <laughs> it's not right. You know what she did. What's going on? Uh, oh. My oh no. Oh boy. Resonance now what? Cascade. <laughs> yeah, oh yeah, teleported <laughs> idiot. Yeah, this does have a few more chapters, doesn't it? Oh no. There's nine, doesn't it? When we're yeah. on it. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, there we go. Get oh. done. Yeah? Shit. What happened? Where are they now? I guess there's gonna be a follow up game. Nice. I guess look forward to the sequel, shit. Yeah, the core team. Mm -hmm. Get it? Black Mesa. <laughs>
Yo, Tristan Snart, let's go! <laughs> Justin Oakley. Can you skip that? I mean, yeah, I don't know. Probably. I want to, I want oh, to no. know. They disabled the fucking, <laughs> they disabled the menu while the credits were You, rolling. you will watch these credits. <laughs> you will. That's probably not that much, it's probably really short. Yeah, no. William Her name is Amelia. Good job. Good job. The voice mm -hmm. acting. Good game. I liked it a lot. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Additional contributors. Oh no, not the th not the three hour long Mighty Number no. Nine credits. <laughs> <laughs> A wild Aaron and Valve. Hmm. Thanks, you really helped us out. It's gonna be like we ended up on fucking Zen or something. Thanks, Paint.net. Thanks, Paint.net. <laughs> VTF edit, crowbar, and source lid. And we couldn't have done Probably. it without Boosh. Probably do some fun stuff. Crawling through the remnants of Black Mesa. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Strato? I'm not sure what that is, actually. Sauce. My favorite part of Black Mesa is they had, like, three or four different teams researching teleportation technology. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Okay. Oh. Hi. Oh. Okay. Oh. 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 We're on space. We're on the moon. Yeah. We're on the moon. Yeah. Yeah. I figured. Chance that you actually survive. You were badly wounded in the eruption. I tried. Are you a core now? Never seen anything like it. Are you a core? Are you a Are you a vacuum? My expertise. Starts and ends at <gasps> Oh, they're gonna make me into Not a core. Buddies. But the best I can do right now oh, is stasis. To put you in stasis. It might help you mm -hmm. heal, but yeah. It's not looking good. Maybe they'll put you in pea body. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Okay. I don't know what to do now. The spy is broken, oh. so we're just stuck on the moon. I guess this is goodbye. Uh, for now. Just for now. Uh, Take care. Uh, hmm. that was Bad a ending. Unlock good ending? Play the <laughs> real game to find out. <laughs> Oh, here, let me see. Because I think there's a. Yeah, we did miss like 10 achievements. Uh, let's see. So we have. Blow up the test chamber sign. Complete the test. Complete the chamber 4 8 4 9 without knocking over any turrets. Take a shower under one of the gel cleansing fields. Uh, deplete the. Deplete the conveyor supply of weighted storage cubes. Complete chamber 5 1 without destroying any turrets. Uh, smear your dirty fingers over Aperture's beautiful glass. <laughs> Stare at Connolly's mannequins for a really long time. Uh, get the ball in 410 to land perfectly in the socket. Deplete the gel supply in cham chamber 411. Uh, solve the chamber huh. 62 twice. And then solve chamber 66 the fun way. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, no other, no other unique weird ending ones. But yeah, no, that was a delightful mm -hmm. little thing. I that hope that... Fun. I hope that the team comes back to do a possible little follow-up with, like, some moon stuff. Or, I don't know, maybe some crazy, mm -hmm. crazy nonsense. Go nuts. Uh, but anyways, yeah, that's the end of the, that's the, end of the, the mod. Good mod. Highly recommend. Mm -hmm. uh, granted, if you already got... I mean, uh, okay, let's be perfectly honest. You don't just play these games for the, for the story stuff. The puzzles are fun, too. <laughs> uh, yeah, give it a shot. All right, bye-bye, everybody. Yay! Bye-bye. <laughs>